Detroit TV. These terriers are ready to run out of TV. Rabbits, badgers, woodchucks, foxes, and even rats. All terriers should be strong and well muscled and robust. Regardless of their size, they should not have great children. These are terrific. And the first one we'll take a look at is Airedale Terrier by the name of Austin. This is the largest of the terrier breeds. In fact, the Airedale is called the king of all terriers. First and foremost, they are a great family companion. Notice the broken coat, which the Airedale is known for. That hard, dense, wiry coat runs straight, close. Movement on this dog should be very, very free. And when we see this dog move right now, you'll see what I'm talking about. Just take a look. They have the excellent reputation with children. And, uh, and Cindy Vogel is our judge trying to get expression. Here's a white bull terrier named Bogey. We have two varieties in this breed. We have the white bull terrier, which we have now, Bogey, and also the colored bull terrier. A very strongly built, muscular, active dog. Look at that intelligent expression. They originally bred as a fighting dog. Today, they're a playful, some other companion animal, very sensitive, quite affectionate. Make wonderful pets and companions. They are happiest when they are They don't do well when they're away from their mates. That's true of many breeds. A lot of breeds are forgetting.